Well, we will be keeping an eye on power outages throughout the day today. Right now, there are 1,100 outages, the most in Topsfield, Boxford, and Lynn. And despite the dangerously cold conditions, people still have to get to work and they need to take their pets outside. So what can you do to stay safe? WBZ's Anna Myler has some answers. It is so windy, it is so cold, and it's only going to get worse as the day goes on. For those who have to commute or take the train, the MBTA is warning about possible delays because of this extreme cold. I'm wearing PJs underneath my pants. I'm wearing like a long sleeve shirt. I'm wearing like a, like a hoodie with this little mask that covers my whole face. And um, yeah, and I'm wearing a hat too. Mario Pena is doing everything he can to stay warm while taking the train into work, but he wishes he didn't have to. You know, I wish I could find a virtual job. That would be amazing. <laughs> Starting this morning, extra crews are on hand for maintenance and to respond to any issues like doors that are frozen open. With extreme drops in temperature, they're also worried about the rails cracking. The interim director says they prepare months in advance for weather like this. I feel that we're as prepared as we can be. Again, these temperature swings are certainly difficult, but we are also prepared so that if there is an incident, that we're quick to respond to address the incident and get service resumed and moving as quickly as possible. Orange Line work has also been called off this weekend, as well as construction on the Sumner Tunnel. It's just too cold for the crews. Logan Airport is also warning passengers that temperatures this low can lead to delays. Many people we talked to plan on just hunkering down today and tomorrow. Oh my gosh, it's so freezing. I just want to be inside, honestly. The pups feel the same way, bundled up and begrudgingly out for a quick walk. He hates it as much as I do, although he does love the attention. <laughs> Associate veterinarian um, Allison Smith like says it's said. important to protect your pets. She recommends putting boots or wax on their paws, dressing them in a coat or sweater, and limiting your time outside. They are vulnerable to frostbite, um, especially in their ear flaps, which they have that thin cartilage. Um, on no long walks, I'd keep it five minutes to ten tops, um, and then come right back in after using the bathroom. Okay. The MBTA is encouraging people to download their app so you can keep an eye on the wait times and reduce the amount of time you're spending outside. Reporting in Somerville, Anna Myler, WBZ News.